Hi, it's Adam with Web Starts. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can add a donation widget to your website using both Donately and Web Starts. Donately is a good donation solution because it allows you to accept both one-time donations and monthly recurring donations directly from your website. So let's say you're a nonprofit organization, maybe you're a church, and you would like to receive monthly recurring donations from a supporter, they can choose to select that option on your website, enter the monthly amount that they would like to give along with their credit card information, and then of course donate now. I'm going to show you how I added this to my website, and I'm gonna start by going to donately.com to do that. I've gone to donately.com and I've already signed up and created an account. If you haven't done that step, you'll need to complete it before you can follow along with the rest of this video. Once you've done that, you'll need to connect a Stripe account to your Donately account. Stripe is a payment processor that allows you to receive credit card transactions directly from your website and Stripe will deposit those donations you receive into your bank account. So you'll need to provide them with your bank account information if you haven't done that as well. I've already set up my Stripe account. So what I'm going to do is focus on the part where you add the donation form to your website using Web Starts. You can do that by clicking the Manage drop-down menu and then choosing the Forms option. Here you'll see a preview of your donation form to the left, and then you'll be able to copy this code that they provide to your clipboard and then paste that into your Web Starts editor. Let me show you how I did that. Going over to the Web Starts editor, click on Insert, HTML code on the page where you'd like that widget to appear, paste the code into the field provided, and then click OK. Lastly, go ahead and use the handles to resize your widget so that it's displayed just the way that you like. When you're ready, be sure to click Save to save and publish those changes. If you go to your live web page, you'll now see that the Donately widget has been added and people are able to provide those donations. That's it for this video. Don't forget to visit webstarts.com to create your very own free website and also see more helpful videos like this.